What's up guys, this is Otik here with um, some more Masquerade Bibles. This time I'm going to show you the locations of each of the hidden treasure chests on each stage. Some of them are not as hidden as others, but yeah. Alright, let's go and look around. Here's Act 1. Alright, see this little bridge here? We need to turn it. What's that sound? This is the second time you come across this bridge. Alright, we turned it the first time. We gotta do it one more time. We get it where we need it at. Alright, once you got the bridge in this position, the only thing you have to do is walk back here a little ways. Alright. Jump up here. And then jump across here. Right, that's a little sketchy. Let's try this. Come on. Yeah, we made it. And just run right across. You'll find a chest. Oh, yeah. Alright, that's Act 1. Chest. Let's go for Act 2. Alright, guys. Welcome back. We're here on Act 2. Here's the chest here. It's... They're towards the end. The boss fight's right up there. I had to go ahead and fight him so all the cannonballs will quit shooting over here. But yeah, you just jump across right here. Do this and down up here. And you got the chest. And everything. And the way to get back out of here is just jump back across. Right over here, there, and there. Alright guys, we're back here. After, on Act 3, after that not ambush, but the decoy part right in here. You just come up here, take a left at the hay bale. Right down, there's a chest sitting right down here for claims. There it goes. Okay. Not that hard for this in there. Just had to look around. All right. Okay, y'all get on. All right, guys, we're on at four for this chest here. Right at three. Well. This dude's obviously, of course, trying to get through. Tell me if he tries to figure out the pattern before getting across here. I'm about to show you. Jump here. Jump with this guy. This one. All right, wait. Then jump right about now. Come across. And you're here at this chest there. Tell me a few seconds to figure it out. All right, guys, we're here on Act 5. It's right here when you get to double roosters on this act. You... Wait for that there to go to sleep. Jump up here on this here. This here. And right up here. And here's the chest. We got a bunch of archers shooting at me. Alright. That's for Act 5. Alright guys. We're on Act 6 at Blues Camp. Right before the boss fight up there. What I did to get here was I walked across the beans. All the way up until about there in the center of my screen. I waited for the chicken or the sentry to go to sleep. Jump down, hit the chest, well, jump on the chest. But there's also two enemies down here you have to kill. It's good to run in this corner, fight them off, grab whatever you need, then run all the way back. Like this here. And you don't have to encounter no fights or nothing down here. Wait for this in here to go away. Alright, come on. And then you can just skip all of that. No down there. That's just no. All right, get back. All right, guys. Here's the chest for Act Seven. As soon as the boulder falls down, you have to come up this side path. When you get here, where the arrow points to the left, don't go that way. Go to the right. It's right down here, where the boulder landed at. See right here in front of me. But here's the enemies. But yeah, that's the location for that. All right, guys. We're here on Act Eight. To get the chest is after you beat the big notes. Come up here before going into the chapel. Go right up here. This alternate way. Jump across these here. And your chest will be sitting right here. Go ahead and claim it. Oh, there it goes. Alright, that's all eight chests. If you like and enjoyed it, please leave a comment and or hit that thumbs up button down below. Alright, catch y'all guys.